Welcome back to the Pantheon Web Ops Certification video training series. I'm your host, Steve Bresnick. In this video, we will talk about some common Pantheon terminology. Specifically, we'll highlight some of the different types of workspace plans and site plans offered on Pantheon. By the end of this video, you should be able to list the features that are available only in professional workspaces, but not in personal workspaces. List and describe the web ops features that are unlocked in the professional dashboard by upgrading to a gold plan. List and describe the features and functionality accessible through the personal workspace. Describe the limitations of Pantheon's free tier sandbox site plans. And describe the timeout policy for live and non-production environments for paid and unplayed site plans. First, let's talk about some terminology. In a prior video, you created a new account on Pantheon. A Pantheon account is associated with a user and a login. The user can log in through the dashboard or through the command line with a machine token. We'll cover this method for logging in when we talk about Terminus, Pantheon's command line interface tool. Each account can be associated with one or more workspaces. Workspaces are groupings of sites, bringing together sites, teams, and features, and simplifying the management of large numbers of sites. You can toggle between different workspaces associated with your account in the account dashboard. There are two types of workspaces on Pantheon, personal and professional. The personal workspace displays tools for the sites you own or are a team member of, your account plan, and billing for sites you own. You have exactly one personal workspace on Pantheon. Every Pantheon user is assigned one personal workspace regardless of whether they have other workspaces assigned to them as well. All sites you create, as well as individual sites from workspaces you've been invited to collaborate on, will be in your personal workspace. WebOps collaboration features such as multi-dev and custom upstreams are not available in personal workspaces. To access these features, you will need a professional workspace. The professional workspace brings together users and sites to allow administrators to effectively manage larger number of sites. You may be a member of more than one professional workspace, and you can switch between your personal and professional workspace or between different professional workspaces on your dashboard at any time. When you first create a professional workspace, it is created with a silver account plan, which gives you access to just the basic capabilities of the Pantheon platform. To take advantage of features such as multi-dev, custom upstreams, and autopilot, you want to upgrade the workspace to a gold plan. Now let's talk about site plans. A Pantheon site is a complete web project that includes all of the elements needed to build, test, and run a website. In general, the terms site and application can be used interchangeably on Pantheon. You can have one site or hundreds. A site has a site dashboard and consists of environments kept in sync through a platform automation. We'll discuss much more about sites and environments in future videos. There are a couple of limitations to be aware of for sandbox sites, which is Pantheon's free site tier. Custom domains are one limitation. Sandboxes only allow for the use of platform domains and do not allow access to the custom domain feature. In order to associate a custom domain with your site, you will need to upgrade to one of the paid plans. Automated backups are also not included with our sandbox site plans. Sandbox sites need to be backed up manually. And finally, inactivity periods. After a certain period of inactivity, sandbox sites will automatically sleep. They can be woken up quickly within eight to 10 seconds by simply pinging the site or visiting the URL in the site dashboard. This timeout period also applies to the non-production environments on paid site plans, but not the production environment or live environment of paid site plans. Next, we have basic site plans. Basic site plans are for small individual sites and non-mission critical sites. They come with a limit of five custom domains, 
20 gigabytes of combined storage for your database and files, and they do not provide access to New Relic, Object Cache, or Pantheon Search. Traffic figures for basic site plans must be below 25,000 monthly unique visitors. Professional site plans typically outgrow basic site plans, and for those we offer performance plans. Performance plans provide a range of resources for sites that have higher traffic and greater importance to the business than basic plans. All performance plans provide access to New Relic, Object Cache, and Pantheon Search. Performance plans also come in sizes that correspond with the expected traffic figures for the sites. Performance Small is for sites that expect less than 25,000 monthly unique visitors. Performance Medium is for sites that are for less than 50,000 monthly uniques. Performance large is for less than 150,000 monthly uniques. Extra large is less than 300,000 monthly uniques. And then we also have a 2XL, which is less than 600,000 monthly uniques. And finally, we have elite plans. Elite plans are for mission critical websites that require a contractually backed uptime guarantee. Any flagship marketing website like your .com site, flagship higher education sites, e-commerce sites that require a guaranteed uptime, and any sites deemed mission critical should use elite site plans. Additionally, any site plans that have exceeded monthly traffic figures surpassing 600,000 monthly unique visits will automatically require an elite site plan. Elite plans include an uptime SLA of 99.95%, with an option to increase the uptime SLA to 99.99% or four nines with our Elite with Multi-Zone Failover plans. Elite plans include managed scaling, which allows Pantheon to automatically scale to meet the demands of unforeseen traffic spikes. In this video, we learned about the features that are available in professional workspaces, but not in personal workspaces the web ops features that are unlocked in the professional dashboard by upgrading to a gold plan, the features and functionality accessible through the personal workspace, and the limitations of Pantheon's free tier sandbox site plans, as well as the timeout policy for live and non-production environments for paid and unpaid site plans. See you in the next video.